So, you have found your way here at last. You know that to stand against mighty Barabos is to throw away your life. And yet you still came. A decision you will come to regret. But not for long, for I shall rend you asunder and devour your innards.
You! How? Curse you! This is not the end! I shall not give up so easily for you! You have at last bested the Archfiend. You have done all that was asked of you. Be proud. Now return to them. Return to those who love you. They are waiting for you.
little champion. I'm so proud and happy I could burst. Oh, if only your father could see you. Just look at you. You've grown into a great adventurer. The spitting image of your father. And I know somewhere out there he's just as chuffed as I am. Indeed, vanquisher of the Archfiend Baramos. Truly, you are your father's child. The kingdom, nay, the whole world salutes you. Servants, a feast must be prepared, the like of which our land has never seen. had finally returned to the land. Will it forever remain beyond our reach? Everyone present, listen, and listen well. My subjects must never learn of Zoma's existence. Their lives have been ruled by unease for long enough. Goddess, which is the path I must take? Ah, forgive me a moment of weakness. Now, please, leave me.
What's the matter? Can't you sleep? Suppose it's no surprise, really. You've been through your fair share. Ooh, just thinking of that horrible voice we heard in the castle sent shivers down my spine. But enough of that. Tell me, do you know what you're going to do next? It's all right. I'm still in shock too. I had hoped this would be the end of it, but I know you can't just stay here. You're just like your father in that sense. Oh, this all brings back memories of when he left Aliahan to go on his journey. His friends presented him with the finest helmet you've ever seen. Everyone came out to wish him well. They were all so joyous. But there was nothing but fear in my heart. I just don't want to lose you too. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't worry. Everything will be all right. At any rate, I'd say it's well past your bedtime. Go on, you must be shattered. We can talk in the morning. Morning, my darling. I suppose it's that time again, eh? I know there's no stopping you. Just promise me you'll take care, all right? And no, I'll be here for you with open arms whenever you come home. So bye for now. Do pop by again if you ever find yourself missing my cooking.